And for some Columbus restaurant owners, the mandate going away is welcome news. 10 TV's Lindsay Mills is live in the short north tonight. And Lindsay, restaurant owners hope that this will bring their diners back. Yeah, they hope so. I spoke to the owner of Catalina's. She has two locations. She says throughout the pandemic, her customers have been extremely loyal. However, the mask enforcement has been challenging on her staff. Now, no matter where you go around town, we all see the same thing when we enter a restaurant. Likely it's that little blue sign on the door that says masks required. Restaurant owners in Columbus and Worthington have had to abide by those rules, requiring those who enter to wear a mask until they're seated and eating. Kathleen Day is the owner of Catalina's, those locations in Harrison West and Clintonville. She says if the mask mandate is lifted, it will be welcomed news. It's such a happy atmosphere and my employees say it feels like family and I've just been so fortunate and this polarizing issue has kind of gotten in the way of that. Now, she doesn't have an opinion either way on masks, and she says she will no longer require her staff to wear masks if that mandate is lifted, but she thinks many of her staff will continue to do so. Again, for this to go ahead, we need city council approval. Live in the short north, Lindsay Mills, 10 TV News.